Hey everybody, it's Billy at Bakersfield Tough and the Motor City Throwdown. Man, I got a text message today from my homie Omar Bravo over at Motor City. And he said, look, I got something serious. I found the best taco place in Bakersfield. And I said, what? And he goes, I'm not kidding, I know tacos. I've had a lot of tacos in my life and I'm telling you that this place is the best place in Bakersfield. I didn't believe it, but people around my work have been talking about it and I had to find out for myself. And he said, they weren't joking and I'm not joking. I said, that's a pretty bold statement you're telling me right now. So I'm gonna find out. We're gonna find out. This place is good as he says it is. Let's check it out. Uh, and I heard that it's located in a church, which I believe is right here on Virginia and Mount Vernon. We have made it here. And uh, you can see kind of a makeshift deal. We're gonna get into it. We're at Mount Vernon and Virginia Avenue. All right, let's get in there to the thick of it, man. Let's see what this is all about. Man, let's get it. With Fred Sanford, That's right? right? And uh, man, you said, now you said, this was the best tacos in town. By far the best tacos in all Central California. That's a bold statement. That's Cause there's a, a lot of good taco makers, well, man. Take it from a fat Mexican, I know. These are the best tacos anywhere. I know, so what makes them so good? That man right there. That man right there? He knows how to make a taco. He knows what makes And all his people know how to make a taco. Oh, man, I can't wait. Cause I, you're not the first person that's told me this. Uh, that's why we're here. It's, it's, it's been a well-kept secret, but unfortunately, everybody's got to know now. Yeah. Tacos del Paisa, the best tacos around. And you can smell it down the street. Oh, man. down the street, around the corner, you can smell it. All right, we're going to get into it. it. Right. What taco stand would be complete with horchata, without horchata? Man, look at that. Who doesn't like horchata? Man? There you go. Thank you. Horchata for you. What number? Um, oh, what number? Your name. Billy. Oh, Billy. Guillermo. Billy. Oh, there you go. Billy. All right. All right, man, let's make our way over here. Thank you. So we got, you got, your options are carne asada, chorizo, chicken, and pesto, right? Which is pork? Yeah. Seasoned pork, right? The seasoned? Yeah. I like that. Man, I like this. That's real good. We're gonna come over here. Of course, you can see the tortilla making going on right here. They can't pump them out fast enough. I will tell you, but there is a lot of people here, man. This is not, this is getting to be well known here in the community. Man. So what is that right there that you're making? What? Quesadilla. Quesa Quesadilla. Quesadilla is right there. All right. Oh man, look at that. They are not stingy with that meat. Set up. There you go. Now, of course, we came here. I will say that they're not gonna give you rice and beans. This is not a place where you come and get rice and beans through tacos, man. This is like authentic tacos here. And uh, you may need a translator. I had to have a translator, which I'm fine with, I get it. And uh, But a lot of people around, they'll help you out. And uh, I can't wait to try it, man. This looks really good. Of course, one thing I like too, which one's mine? They give you the old school Coca-Cola bottles, man. Man, that's retro, I like that. That's cool, all right. Sammy's first time trying horchata. Sammy, give it a whirl and give us your opinion on horchata. Thumbs up! Sammy gives the horchata a thumbs up. It's one of my favorites. Hey, hey, hey. Uh, uh, you remember the same thing, right? And I can remember, I can break us some on. And to chocolate milk in here, it's bright chocolate milk. Oh, so it's like chocolate milk. Yeah. But it's not chocolate. It's horchata. Man, we're here with Hector and his family, right? And uh, man, you've come here a few times. Right, yeah, we've been coming here for the past uh, six months or so. Yeah. And it's the tacos are great, the food, I don't think I have had nothing that has been bad here. Yeah. Everything that I get. Right, you know um, what threw me for a loop? I was all, because I usually you go places that have rice and beans, right? All, not here, right. man, this is authentic no. yeah, taco is, right here. Yeah, just tacos. Quesadillas, huaraches. Yeah. Yeah, everything. The salsas are good. Yeah. Um, so, yeah, we have. The kids like it? You kids like, like it? You like it? Yeah, it's 
Yeah. What's your favorite kind of taco here? My favorite kind of taco is the... Um, Pastor or asada? Asada. Asada? Yeah. Alright, I'm doing the combo. I'm going to try them all. I can't wait. Yeah. So Alright. It'll be great. This is the combo plate. Of course, man, a lot of uh, onions and looks like guacamole maybe. And I'm going to come over here. So I'm a huge lime fan. Oh yeah, look at that. Oh, I'm gonna have to dig into that too. Man, that's good. Oh man, big onions too. Oh, this is what I like right here. It's the big stuff. Right, so first thing is they're delivered in these little pouches. I like that, nice and clean. Man, you can eat the taco without the juice running all over the place. That's pretty good right there. Man, that's good. You know what I like about it? I'm just letting my palate take control here. It's super moist. The meat is not dry at all. That is really good. And I noticed that they use a combination of um, grill and put it in the pot, right? With water or whatever they got in there. And I'm sure that keeps it moist. Super good. As you can see, my daughter here has pounded the horchata, dude. I haven't even been paying attention. You have pounded that. You drank that very fast. Actually, this is, I think I'm back. This is the pork here. Sammy's gonna try it. Sammy, give us your honest opinion. Honest opinion, wait a second, take it in. Chew it. Take it in. All right, what's your opinion on that taco? Can you give me a, a thumbs up? Sammy gives it a, a, a two thumbs up. Are you serious? All right, I tried to figure out what I was eating here because I thought, I went, you know, we had a combination. I thought I was gonna get one taco this, one taco that, but it's not. They actually mixed everything together. So within this taco is chicken, carne asada, and pork. Is carne asada and pork the same thing? I don't think it is, right? Maybe it is, I don't know. Or a paston, is that right? I'm saying it wrong, man. I know you guys are gonna catch me on this. But anyway, it's a mixture of all three in this one taco. And man, it is, I'm not even kidding. This is a, this is a five-star taco right here. Have, uh, these three taco plates, they're very much not stingy with their meat. That's really cool. Of course, they got big uh, chilies, onions, and all that stuff. Two of these large Coke bottles, pretty cool. Of course, the Ochata. And uh, $16.50 for all, for all this. Not bad, not bad. Part of her taco, which is the carne asada with cheese. Dude, I'm not even kidding, man. Because mine didn't have cheese, I don't think. Mine just had the combination, a little bit, but not like hers. Holy smokes, was that good, dude. Oh, man. Carne asada with the cheese is solid. Man, I was trying to leave, and they handed me this. Now, what is this called? El Vampiro. El Vampiro? Yeah. What is it? I've never seen this before. Is this an original creation, or has this been around for a while? Well, I don't know, man, but it looks, I'm going to say it. We have what looks to be a taco shell with cheese on it, with carne asada, guacamole, right? Am I saying it right? Yeah. Onions. Whoa. That's a work of art right there. Oh man, I'm gonna try to force this down. I just have four tacos. I love it. Thank you very much. Here we go. We're wrapping it up here. Tacos and Pasita, right? They're open from 9 to 12, seven days a week. They have a Facebook. And a lot of people right now, arguably, are saying this is the best taco place in Bakersfield. And after having it, I'm not sure I can argue because this is a solid taco. I think they also do tortas here too. I could be wrong. And they do quesadillas, but don't come here looking for rice and beans. They're not, you're not gonna get that here, right? You're not gonna get that. We've had people say that real taco stands don't have rice and beans, so don't come here to get rice and beans. All right, there you go. All right, we're out of here. Gracias.